heard on a liturgy podcast and on a website or two that um, there's a sexual nature to the Eucharist. Um, can you, have you heard of that or can you expand on that? I've heard people say that um, and I don't, uh, so if I'm trying to take that in as generous a way as possible, well, there's clearly a sexual nature to the Eucharist in that the Eucharist is Jesus, and Jesus has a sexual nature. He's male. Um, but that, I don't think, is what people who are making this claim mean by what they're saying. Frankly, I don't know what they mean. Um, I, it, I, it, I, it, I assume that they are trying to sketch an analogy between the way we receive communion and the sex act where a woman receives something from a man and okay they're both acts in which and that would cast the minister of the eucharist in a masculine role and especially the celebrate the celebrating priest and then the people who receive communion in a feminine role uh, having said that just because two things both involve a reception doesn't mean that that's a helpful analogy to immediately analogize something to the sexual act. I mean, if I hand Cy a beer, you know, let's... This is so much better than yesterday when Trent kept killing me off. Well, yeah. I was going to say it could be a poisoned beer, oh, okay. but, oh, okay. um, right. but if I hand Cy a beer, yeah. that doesn't, and he receives it, that doesn't instantly suggest that we should analogize this to a sexual act. In fact, it would be very unhealthy to do so. It's just a simple act of giving someone a beer. As even Sigmund Freud said, sometimes a cigar is just a cigar. And so um, I don't particularly find attempts to sexualize the Eucharist helpful. Uh, having said that, you know, if people are able to articulate uh, a, a, a version of this that helps them get closer to God, that is based on elements that are true, okay, um, but I don't find it helpful, and I don't think most people find it helpful to hear a sexualized understanding of the Eucharist. What do you think, Amelia? Yeah, no, I I agree. It it didn't help me whatsoever. Actually, it made me pretty uncomfortable. So <laughs> yeah. no, that helps a lot. Thank you both. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The whole discussion made me uncomfortable, but the uh, it does seem to be a kind you of want a beer. I mean, maybe thanks. Could chill you? out yeah. afterwards. <laughs> yes, and a cigar. But um, uh, it does seem to be an affliction of our age that mm -hmm. uh, people just want to sexualize everything. Yeah, no, nothing gets left out of that.